Welcome here. This is the Quiet Riot Show. It's a podcast about men's mental health. I'm Tim. I'm Tommy. And we're going to talk about a lot of different stuff in regards to men's mental health. We're going to tell stories. We're going to talk about our journeys and our stories and our ongoing journeys. Um, We're going to bring a lot of people in here and discuss their stories and uh, break that out. And by no means are we mental health or healthcare professionals in any sense. Um, this is just people talking about life with other people who also are living life. Yeah, exactly. Like you mentioned, you hit the nail right on the head. Um, we are no professional. We don't have any, uh, education other than, uh, our own experiences that we went through, uh, in the past, whether it's relationships or, uh, you know, I had, I was going through a career change, which we'll talk about. Um, we're going to have different guests that dealt with different, uh, issues, challenges. challenges, Yeah. Yeah. And they're just going to tell our, their story. And hopefully that story will influence somebody. Maybe we'll help somebody to kind of go through their tough times. Yeah. It's one of those things that's, it's like, even just sitting here, it feels uncomfortable to talk about it does it does and yeah and, and like not we, just because this is the first time we've done a show the two of us together but we've had lots of chats yeah and it's one thing when there's no microphones in front of you that's we, right we've talked about our own mental health we've been friends for years and our journeys and our stories and um but in a different way that's right and uh i think the sharing portion and the, the i mean the title of the show is quiet riot and it's that that inner struggle and that that battle that's going on inside you that you tend to keep to yourself or I, sorry, I shouldn't speak for anyone else, but like for me, you know, you want to be tough. You want to, I can't, I can't break down about this. I don't want to, I don't want to break down about this. And we all have our own reasons for putting up walls and doing that and, and keeping it quiet. And I think for me, this is a great venue to not keep it quiet. Yeah. And I, I think throughout the, the, the episodes, we're going to talk about like how we're men. We're almost not supposed to be sharing our feelings. We're just supposed to kind of, you know, deal with it and uh, don't worry about it. Yeah, push it down, bury yeah, it down, exactly. yeah, bury, bury it, it down. and don't worry about it. You're a man; <laughs> yeah. you should be able to deal with this. But we're gonna share some stats about like suicide rates and, and things like that. That it, it's it's actually um, pretty tough for some some men out there. And um, I personally talk about my issues feelings very easily to really anybody <laughs> maybe some people don't mind don't like that <laughs> anyone that, much. that wants to hear it <laughs> <laughs> exactly hey <laughs> guess what i'm sad today <laughs> <laughs> but uh, maybe if we all did that it would be better right? actually <laughs> yeah, exactly but uh you know i personally lost three friends over the last three years to suicide and uh, and it, it kind of really makes you question like what that person was going through because have i thought of it yeah, it went through my mind absolutely. You know, I never got to that point, and I but because I talked about it. But some aren't as outgoing, maybe as I am. Yeah, and I think I, I do feel like in general, this you know, if we would have talked about this topic fifteen years ago, yeah. it would have been a very, very different uh, response, a different situation. We would have had a very slim list of guests who wanted to actually come here and, mm-hmm. and be vulnerable and right. explain that story, and so I. I want to also say that, like, I feel like there has been lots of progress made on this subject. Absolutely, and I'm I'm happy about that. That yeah, makes me feel that makes me feel good. And it feels it, it feels hopeful. And when you don't feel hopeful, all you want to do is feel hopeful. And so it's one of those things that you can cling to, and you know that I clung to and said, "This is something I can at least talk about now." And like, yeah. something that like people will listen and want to help and want to hear the story and want to be a part, want to be vulnerable with you. Absolutely. So, yeah, that's what we're going to talk about. Yeah. So, uh, this is just a little intro. Again, can't stress it enough. We're not professional. We're just simply here to share a story, create a, a safe uh, environment for our guests to show up here. Uh, whether it's going to be in person or via Zoom, we'll see. Uh, uh, but, you know, we want to be able to just sit here, shoot the shit, talk about uh, our issues that we've had, and talk about how we dealt with it and just kind of. Yeah. Share it with everybody. It'll be dark. Listen to the show. We'll try and not make it too dark and too moody all the time. That's right. (laughs) I I think we're pretty fun guys. We've done other shows that are focused around everything but serious, so I I think we we can find a balance. That's right. Be patient with us. All right. Cheers. Cheers.